Good morning guys, I am getting a getting ready for a quick day out so I thought I would film this. It's really really easy and I did this look yesterday and a lot of my friends complimented me on my look so I want to show you guys how I got it. It's very easy so I thought I'd do it for you guys today. So I've already done my foundation, my concealer and my powder. That's Estee Lauder Double Wear, um, Estee Lauder Smoothing Primer, Estee Lauder uh, Powder and I'm using the Pro um, LA Girl Pro Concealer under my eye. The powder I used is the Duo powder, which is like a highlighting powder. It's beautiful. Alrighty, so now I'm going to go ahead. I'll put. This, so I just wanted to show you guys this. I love it. It is the Sweet Peach Glow Palette. Um, one of my friends has let me borrow it over the weekend, and it's amazing. Shout out to Briar. She is starting out her YouTube channel, so if you guys go and check her out, I'll link her down below. So I'm using the blusher which literally smells like peach. So nice. I've just used the blusher, now I'm gonna go ahead and use the highlighter. Oh, this is really nice and soft. It's very pretty. Looks like very shiny on camera, which is amazing. Wow, my skin looks incredible with that. That's gorgeous. Gotta put that glow everywhere. I know that this is huh, sweet blushing. It's a bronzer. Um, so, but it looks like really close to my skin tone. So I'm just gonna take a bit of this and add it to that bronzing area. But I have a feeling that it's very similar to my skin tone. So it's just gonna give me a glowy complexion. Still nice though. So that is amazing. Oh my gosh, I just wanna eat it. It smells divine. If you guys haven't tried this yet, go and um, give it a go in your closest um, store that sells Too Faced. Um, so yeah, it's just gorgeous. I love the smell. I could just live and breathe the smell of that. That's amazing. Make that into perfume, Too Faced. That would be amazing. Okay, I've also got these two palettes also from Briar. Um, again, her channel's linked down below. Go and check her out. Um, she would have used a lot of these. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and use some of these colors. But first, I actually want to lay down a little bit of yellow. So this is by MAC. It is called Golden Rod. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous yellow shade. So what I'm going to do is pop that all the way through my crease and that's just going to warm everything up. And we are going to be using a super, super bright gold in this look, so kind of makes sense to use this shadow. So this is just a base, basically, for the look. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and take the Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette. The colours I'm going to be using are quite a few of the matte shades because I have another palette that I want to use for the glowy shades. So right now I'm just going to take these two here. I'm going to start out with Sourced, which is just super nice and natural. And then I'm going to go ahead and take Low Blow. And then with a smaller brush, I'm going to take those same, same mix those colours together and just go straight underneath the eye. Quite blow now, I want it to be really soft. Now I'm just going to take a dense brush like this dude, and this is He Devil. It's this colour right here, which is quite orangey. I'm just going to really pack that on that outer C. And then again, fluffy eyeshadow brush and blend that through. Nothing's going as high as the yellow that I put down before, guys, so it's just kind of just reaching it. Right, so that's it. It's very soft. It's not a very bold eye look. Then we're going to go ahead and take the Too Faced Chocolate Gold Palette. Again, this is from Briar. Look at those amazing, incredible colours. So gorgeous. So, um, I'm going to take, obviously, the really, really big one, this gold colour right here, and put that all over my eyelid. I'm just going to take my finger, and it's just going to go right in the centre like that, and then I'm just going to start really lightly, dabbing it outwards for now. I'm just going to take this synthetic brush because it's kind of thin but fluffy still. It's going to go around those edges just like that. Because I want the brightest part to be right in the centre and then kind of almost fade out. I just tasted that. That's so odd. It must have been in the air and I sucked it in. That is amazing. It tastes good, guys. I'm going to... This is weird, but I'm going to try it later. Right, then I'm going to take a little bit of the gold, chocolate gold again and just go right on top just to make sure that's nice and vibrant. 
looks amazing right and then I'm just going to take a little bit of rich girl which is this color right here and I'm just gonna take it into the inner corner I can't help but do this with a look <laughs> it's just something I have to do I just want to try it it's on my finger shoot that tastes like chocolate what that's weird that's so weird <laughs> and cool obviously very cool but like what it's going in a bit more with that heat wave palette just whatever's left in my brush and just creating a little bit more shape and then just coming in with my fluffy brush and blending that through so now I'm just going to take some eyeliners these are the double wear um, eye pencils by Estee Lauder and they are in onyx and coffee so I'm going to take onyx and put that up in the uh, roots of the top lash line and then I'm going to put this in my waterline down the bottom and I'm just going to bring the coffee slightly lower on the outer edge there and just blend it okay I'm going to try the coffee on the top lash line and just see how dark that goes so now I'm just going to use the sumptuous extreme mascara by Estee Lauder so I just want really really thick lashes and when I want that that's when I go for this mascara So I didn't curl my lashes for this and the reason is I want it to be a little bit more doe-eyed. If I curl my lashes it makes my eyes look super, super big and I'm already making my eyes look quite large because the colours I've used are very big, like bold and bright. I'm making sure to get the top of my lashes. And I'm just going to do my bottom lashes. This is the Estee Lauder dark brunette it's the brow multitasker I'm just gonna take that and it's also got powder in there as well and then a brush on the other end it's so handy I'm just gonna brush through them now with my spoolie on the other end I don't mind too much if I get it on the skin because I'm going to clean it up. I'm just going to take the powder in the middle there and that goes through the thicker end. It gives the eyebrows some colour and a bit more dimension and especially if you've got quite sparse eyebrows that part is really helpful. Amazing. Now I'm just going to go ahead and take uh, my concealer brush and just whip that around and make sure everything is looking nice and defined and you can see the eyebrow difference this is a lot more defined it's a lot more shape to it and then this one even though yes it's dark and quite full it's not as it's quite sparse and just unshapely so we'll do the other side and I'll be back so the lip stuff I've got is the double wear lip pencil in clear and then I've also got the other double wear lip pencil in coral so I'm going to take clear and put that all around my lips to stop any bleeding then I'm going to take a little bit of lip balm just to smooth my lips out actually this is a lip volumizer okay so now I'm just going to trace the edge of my lips So you could almost leave it like that, but one more thing I'm going to do, I'm going to take my Estee Lauder Defiant Coral Lipstick. This is such a gorgeous colour. This is one of my go-to favourite lipsticks just by the way guys. So I'm just looking at my skin as opposed to like everything and I love the peach palette, I think it's really really pretty for the face but I think because my skin tone's darker I need something more so I'm just gonna take Witty Peach which is actually one of my all-time favorites and I think you guys know this by now I use this one all the time and then I'm just gonna take Bronze Goddess by Estee Lauder this is an incredible bronzer I love it just to warm myself up a little bit Cool, lovely, and then I'm just going to go ahead and take a little bit more highlighter. This one here is Moon Glow by Bobbi Brown. A little bit extra highlighter. Because why not? Just on the cheekbones, nowhere else. Everywhere else has still got a little bit. 
And then I'm just going to use some Fix Plus spray to give myself a bit of hydration, add some glow to my skin mm. and finish it all off. I could just keep going with that stuff, honestly. So good. I'm just going to go put my summer dress on and I'll be right back. So this is the dress I'm wearing. This is actually from Chiffon Boutique a, wee, a few wee years ago, back when she was just a Facebook page. <laughs> but, you know, she makes amazing stuff, so I'll link her, her um, website down below. Um, so you can't really see it because now I look naked. <laughs> but um, oh, I'll lean back here. Awesome! So this is the finished look. Nice and summery, lots of fun. I think I could probably put on a necklace and make it look a little bit cuter. I wish I had time to curl my hair, but it's time for us to go out now. But I do really love this look. I think if my hair was curled, it would look a lot better. But you guys can see it suits this dress a lot. Uh, yeah, so that is the look. Thank you guys so much for watching. Everything is linked down below, so go check it out. Um, also, don't forget to check out Briar's channel. It is linked down below. She is gorgeous, and she's one of my really dear friends. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Everything is linked down below. Please let me know also in the comments um, section, what is your favorite food? I want to know. What is your favorite food? Let's start a conversation down below. And my favorite food is probably pizza. I think pizza would have to be my favorite. Also, I really, really enjoy ice cream, but pizza. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up so I know. And also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and you like videos like this one. I hope you guys have a lovely day wherever you are and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.